Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to Footy with Sharpie. And I'm going to tell you about last week's results. Round 22. So West Coast 125 defeated Richmond 45. Who did you tip, Ron? Uh, West Coast. I they guess. were way too strong at home. Jade Rawlins, he's a dud coach of Richmond. Second game was the Cats 94 54. And welcome back, Brad Islands, for his first game. Was that the first? First game, well done, Brad. Hawthorne. 99 to 116, and, and what happened here was Matthew Hodge getting a bit, just hit someone, I can't, I can't demonstrate it, we've got nobody else to demonstrate it on. And he'll get off? No. no. And Carlton went down 104 to 176 to the, to the Adelaide Prize, how were you feeling at that, about that? Oh, not good mate. 65 point win. They were dark horses close to the finals. Very much. You like the bloody West Tigers with the NRL. Port Adelaide, 67 to 71. Well, the Roos had to shun the siren. Drew Patrick, 20 metres out, has won the game by four. It was 18,000 at Amy Stadium. What a shotgun crowd of football. Sydney, 92 went down to Brisbane, 100. Oh, I picked Brisbane. And Melbourne, I was going to back the t at the TAB, you, you know that you know in level one there's a TAB down there. I was going to back Melbourne 1950 to win the day. They bloody ran off that Jawa guy in the third quarter for the whole quarter. Me and my mate were going, what the heck's going on here? Collingwood got smashed by the Doldies, 170 sets in front of, that was about 55,000 at Eddie had stayed in for that game. I want to talk about Mad Monday for the bottom eight sides. Well, first there was a bloody Richmond Tigers in the theme of Bri wearing the blend win and pin. That's a stupid fin to do. Jade Rollins, why would be finding wearing pin, mate? Just to pick up some girls where you've been, cousin, just stupid dickhead. You don't wear blend, mate, just to all bloody weird. <laughs> Oh, you're in the Port Adelaide people. They were in a shop in Port Adelaide, in Adelaide, wasn't it? Buying all these suits and rolling three eyes just on his bloody mobile phone. And there's Brendan Ray just standing like a fool, mate. Mark Williams, I remember how you choked yourself in that o the 04 grand final. Or you choked yourself when Port won and the fight started. Alistair Inch and Dallin Wakeland. And in the 07 grand final, Mark Williams, his wife had a baby, so he could not coach that game. That's Mad Monday. Tune in to Mad Monday. Oh, Rodney Hayes, you're getting pumped, are you, idiot? Pumping the fist up, I am all on aid. Thank you. I've set up a special board for Finals Fever, and we'll cut to that now. Welcome to Finals Fever. I'm John Sammy Newman, reporting the for the footy show. The first game is St Kilda versus St Kilda versus Colin with MCG Sunday 240. Well, I'm going for St Kilda to win that game by about seven goals for that that stupid dickhead with the gold jacket in a Colin would chase, but he's an absolute dickhead. He always bads everyone's teams. Who are you going for, boys? Oh, I'll go the Saints. I think the Saints just. I'll get a pies. Oh, the pies. You're going for an upset at Eddie at the G. Yeah, just a shake up. And the second game is a first elimination final. Adelaide versus Essen at Amy saying Friday night at 8.15. It's on TV, the 8, 8.30. I think the Trolls will be far too strong at home. The Trolls should win that by about 36 points. What do you reckon, boys? Crows all the way. Can't tip the Bombers no. in this. Can't tip the Bombers. Crows to win. Thank you. And this is how the board's going to go. Now we're going to show you the other two games. Now I need my paper. <laughs> Joe. In the next game, Brisbane no one's versus Carlton Football Club. The jab is set by 7.30. Well, I reckon Brisbane will win that just, even with five players out. Who are you going for, Owen? I'm going for Carlton. Carlton? Blues will be up against the Crows. There we go. And the next game, oh, shit, I need me paper. And the next game is my team, the Cats, up against the Bulldogs. MCG set that too for I'm very, I'm not happy that I wouldn't, I really wouldn't go to this game, but who cares? The Cats by four goals will be really tight game. What are you reckon, Ryan? Bulldogs? Less Ooh. than a kick. One out the room. Thank you. Bye. I think the Cats will just scrape in. Thank you, Adam. The Cats will be moving to play. You've got to be joking. Wait, it's a G. Well, the Western Bulldogs, you wouldn't be either. 
play my friends team and they had this and curing the pain went fine away. You've not won too many teams up there though. Yeah, no. No, I haven't. Well, we've just fits up the board, but this is how it's built in Venetia, but I don't think this is right, but what I did was right before we just muddled it up again. Well, that's right, the Bulldogs Lions. So I'm going for the Bulldogs to win against the Lions by 21 points. Good, good ball, the Lions. Not happy, you're not happy Mike, with us now, are you? Med five, well, Troy's beat him round one of the season. His Nets weight, eight at the J, 92,000 plus. Who do you reckon? Don't pick the pies. I'm picking the pies. They're, they're dangerous, the pies. Well, yeah. actually, I'm going for the crows. The crows will make a good go of it. So, Nets weight, what will happen is, Saints will play them. Good. And we'll, and this is what happens. I'm getting really nervous now. Jayon will host the Emily final. And the Saints and the Bulldogs are. Whoa. I hope. I'm, I'm actually going for the Bulldogs. I can't stand and kill the footy club anyway. With the Bulldogs' little guns, Josh Hill. They've got late John O. Acker. They'll beat St. Kilda by just 10 points at the G Nets, Nets Friday night. Goodbye, Ross Lawrence. I've been a nice guy there and I'm happy to say the Saints are gone, mate. We've got the Cats and the Crows. Who are you Who are you going for, boys? It has to be you. Uh... Alright, Geelong. Yeah, Cats. You're going to change, I just knew it. The Cats to beat the Crows by less than a kick at the G. I'll be there, ready to go, mate. Fire it up. It's all right, the Cats. And the dogs, grand final owner. And I've said this all year that would happen. And my tip for the brand night, go out with it, three dollars. Satan will win it, Joel Selwood. Who do you reckon? I think Chris Judd. And Satan? Better Mark not, Murphy. Better not be Alan Dyer. <laughs> the siren's gone. Jono after the sign to win the grand final for the dogs. Brad Johnson. Snap up the soil and it's right at the Cats win it at the grand final by a point. Jono's not out there, he, he's rotten. Rodney A is absolutely in tears about that. We've won it by a point. 99.98. John O. Sprayer. We'll wrap up the show now. And next week we'll be into the semi final 1 and 2 and PM we final 1 and 2. Stay sharp. Have a good night, Australia. And I should be on my way home soon. See you all. Go to Cutters!